Over the past six months, CEOs have begun to wake up to the real business benefits of social media platforms, in particular LinkedIn. Gradually, senior managers and boards are realising that the tactical siloed approach to social media is a waste of not only time but also money. Typically the domain of the marketing department, social media platforms like LinkedIn can be exploited for much wider reaching business support, including HR and sales. Let's take business development as one example. CEOs can use LinkedIn to build new relationships with prospective customers via industry groups focused around their own sector, their own geography, or even their own job function. The sheer volume of data that can be mined on companies and on individuals ahead of a tender, for example, can also offer a competitive edge which the other companies tendering may not have access to. So put simply, LinkedIn is a business-oriented social media site which allows users to create profiles and to connect with each other in an online social network. You may already have a marketing team who look after your social media accounts, but as a CEO you can best utilise business opportunities by having your own personal LinkedIn account. Before you create a profile, it's really important that you learn what LinkedIn can do for you. This might include developing a professional brand and identity, expanding your network and interacting with other professionals. Or you might decide to use LinkedIn as a business intelligence tool by reading targeted news from a number of subject specific groups you might follow, for example. So a LinkedIn account has many functions beyond just managing your relationships. Imagine you've been asked to give a talk at an event or a conference. With a quick search for the requesting company, you can find out whether that company is actually relevant to your needs. Are they legitimate? Are they a good contact for you? How will they benefit your particular business goals? If you're looking to hire the newest, hottest commodity in your sector, LinkedIn can be used as an online CV database. It allows you to search for exactly the kind of person that matches your job specification. Checking whether they've worked with anyone you know or belong to any groups that you're a member of can build that level of trust before you even get around to interviewing them. LinkedIn can also be used as a search engine for finding unique skill sets you're looking for, whether it's a company or an individual, whether you need a service or if you're conducting marketing research, LinkedIn allows you to contact them directly. So where do you start? Well, LinkedIn is about reflecting your vision, your services and your branding. So begin by writing a summary which succinctly conveys to people what your company stands for. Tell them about your role and your responsibilities as a CEO. You don't need to bombard your profile with really personal information and irrelevant statuses or casual conversations, but do try to add some personal interest to show that there's a human face behind the brand. So to summarise, I would encourage CEOs not to be blinkered and view LinkedIn as a distraction. Instead, they should fully exploit social media platforms per se to build their profile and their thought leadership. This will help to amplify and enhance the work that's already being done via other business and marketing channels. So please drop me an email or a message on LinkedIn or Twitter if you'd like more information, or come and join our event during Social Media Week London on the 23rd of September.